and the way we groove. Yes, indeed. That was the music of Follow Care there. Lift him high. Definitely self explanatory. Some gospel music for you. Uh, Follow Care is a gospel artist based right here in Toronto. Now, um, how? tell me something. Uh, you know, it's tough as a local Toronto artist or mm -hmm. Canadian artist to really break out in this market. Um, first of all, how is your music received in? in the community, in our right. African community, right. and also how, what are some of the challenges and how are you overcoming those challenges with music? Right. So far, so good. I mean, I've been uh, received pretty well. Um, I did a demo launch on November 2nd. I had a good turnout. Um, people have been buying the demos. Uh, people are downloading the song on iTunes. Uh, people are inviting me to perform at their churches, you know, et cetera. So, so far, so good. Um, you know, definitely it's hard for artists to break, you know, break through uh, regardless of where you are, uh, where you live. But um, I just look at it like, you know, one day at a time, have faith and just believe in yourself. That's all you can do and the opportunities will come. All right, that's what's up. And we, we, Ms. Kotoko, you talked about performances earlier on. Yeah, earlier on the show, we were talking about the performances, but um, I'd like to know what particular performance um, stood out the most. Mm -hmm. You know what? I would have to say all the performances I've done um, the last year or so have been memorable. However, I'd have to say at my demo launch because um, I really got to connect with the audience and I got to really have an intimate moment with them mm -hmm. and uh, they got to hear all my uh, singles and I just felt like it was a really beautiful moment just you know being able to perform in front of people in that intimate, intimate setting. So I would say that's probably the most memorable for me. Yeah. All right. So, and who, who are some of your musical uh, influences? Like who are the people that you look up to? Is it gospel artists or is it... It's just artists in general. It's a mixture of both. Like, I love Michael Jackson, right? Okay. You know, he's, he's a legend. I think he's very talented. In the gospel world, I would say Mary Mary. I like their music. It's hype. It's catchy. But at the same time, the message is very strong. Okay. And I think being able to combine those two things, it's really, really amazing. So I really think that they're they're great. Mary Mary. All right. That's what's up. Follow K is in the building. It's, it is G987 FM each and every Sunday from 12 to 2 playing the best in African music, and of course, bringing you the best in African artists from gospel music to any genre of music out of Africa, right here with your truly MC Bond, the Miss Go-To Girl, and of course, Tag with the African Intern. Um, let's play another song from Folu K, a big song as well. Uh, one of uh, her classics out of uh, her single. Now, you had the demo come out, and you put out the demo. On November 2nd. And how many tracks were on the demo? There's five tracks on the demo. Five tracks, okay. Yes. And we'll talk more on how people can download your music and how people can buy the music from you. Sure. This is um, Draw Me Close, yes. and it is G987 FM. Keep it locked. More music coming up right here on G987.